Hello and welcome to this week's Roundup. It's been a fantastic week at CCA, particularly with a real focus on mental health and mental health awareness for students. It's a really key topic. It's really important that students feel healthy, uh, healthy bodies and healthy minds. And this week the focus has been ensuring that loneliness is something that students know how to deal with, know how to support each other in, and we've done a whole range of activities to support students' mental health and wellbeing. So this week, students have taken part in Just Dance at lunchtime, Dodgeball at lunchtime. Students and staff have worked together and stamping a print of their hands on canvas to actually talk about how they feel and using the canvas as that's displayed around the academy. There was tea and talk sessions where students are able to come in, have a cup of tea, talk to an adult and share some of the challenges that they're facing and the adult to work with them and just listen to them but also to give them strategies to help support them in their everyday life. It's great to see students chatting with each other, it's great to see students um, being a real care and a real support for each other as well as having groups within their year that they can go to in their times of trouble and when they need support. It's been brilliant to see everyone working collaboratively and collectively together to support each other as part of our, our mental health and wellbeing week. During tutor time, students also wrote letters which are delivered to people within the tendering area who live on their own. These letters have been deliver delivered and um, it's about forging those links with the community, but also letting people know that we are thinking of them and the ability for a young person uh, to write to an adult and to share that experience has been really, really powerful. So thank you to the students who have taken part in that. Six Formers this week have been on a trip to Harry Potter World as part of their pre-production work, as part of their media course, um, and it was great. They had a fantastic time. They discovered the magical mischief of Warner Brothers uh, on their studio tour. They looked at the making of Harry Potter. They experienced the wizarding world of the iconic sets and understanding what it is that brings these Harry Potter films to life. Students were an absolute credit. Um, they behaved impeccably well and the six formers that went had an absolutely fantastic time. I'm looking forward uh, to doing more trips with more students as we get into the final part of the summer term. Next week, we have the World Tour series of cycling coming to Clacton, and on Thursday the 19th of May, groups of students are gonna work uh, with Miss McLaren and go out and about, look at the tour, and take part on electric bikes um, as part of the school getting engaged in the World Tour series. Next up, the shout outs. First up, Mrs. Slim. She wants to nominate Ethan Webb. He has been uh, fantastic in class. She's extremely proud of his confidence, the ability to stand up in assembly and talk about his history project. Um, really polite, really focused. Well done, Ethan. Um, you're an absolute star. Next up, Miss Hughes. Miss Hughes wants to say her star of the week has been Katie Edgel. Uh, Katie has been inspired to dial deeper into her love for creative writing. She speaks to members of staff about how to build on this. She's currently looking to submit her wonderful work into a competition. So Katie, well done on all that you've done and keep up your wonderful work. Next up, Miss Goff. Miss Goff wants to say her star of the week is Amy May Ross. Amy is constantly polite, kind, supportive of other students. She's extremely friendly during tutor time and always offering uh, to help and support where she can. She's particularly good at helping Miss out with her numeracy ninjas and uh, ensuring that students are taking part. So well done. Next up, Tracy Blake uh, in 8 KMI um, for her work in English, doing additional work after school to continually improve her learning and her progress. Uh, always with a smile on her face. Well done for your hard work, Tracy. Next up, uh, a message from Miss Kagang. A big shout out to Shardy, Talia, Charlotte, um, Miley and Dillinger for all their uh, all their work in French these past couple of weeks. They've worked hard, particularly on their pronunciation. They're doing well in their lessons, making really, really good progress. So well done to all of you. Next shout out is from Miss Snipe. She wanted to give a big shout out to Lucia, uh, Jodie Lee and Callum, as well as Aaron, who have worked particularly hard on their speeches in English over the last three weeks. These are part of their, um, their English speaking and listening as they put these speeches together present them to the class. It's really tough to do, but it's great for their confidence and it's brilliant to see these students thriving. So well done to you. Next up, Miss Allington. She wants to do a massive shout out to her 9YPE class. Had a brilliant lesson today on race walking. The amount of effort was absolutely top draw. Uh, she's really impressed with all, all of you. So well done uh, to 9Y. This has also been um, the end for year 11 as they now start to move into their exam practice. They now have their revision sessions 
And next week on Monday, we have our first GCSE, which is the uh, sociology exam. On Tuesday is our combined science exam. And then on Wednesday, our English language paper one. So the exams are now starting thick and fast. A big well done to those students who have done their um, speaking and listening in MFL this week, as well as the BTEC exams that have been running um, during this week as well. So year 11, this is it. Fantastic for all you've done. Um, I hope you have a good weekend, a good rest. And for those students today in year 11 who are getting their ice creams for all of their hard work and for their attendance at school, well done to you. And to everyone else in year 11 who hasn't been 100% attendance this week, make sure that starts on Monday as we reset every lesson, attending, exams on time, every day, you'll get an ice cream at the end of the week to say well done. So to everybody, I wish you a really sunny and happy weekend. Uh, to year 11, get those revision books out, really focus for this weekend. I look forward to seeing you in your exams on Monday. Thank you.